Flocks of locals gathered on the banks of the river Itaquai to watch the suspect lead the police to the site of investigation. After 10 days of searches, the presumed bodies of journalist Dom Phillips and indigenous expert Bruno Pereira were found. Police say a 41-year-old confessed to killing the two men using a firearm. We carried out a complete reconstruction of the crime and then we went to the place where the suspect said he had buried the bodies and also the place he said he had hidden the boat. He sank the boat, as the investigation showed. The suspect is a fisherman from the Javari Valley where the two men went missing. His brother was also arrested and is held for questioning. Brazilian authorities were initially criticized for a slow start in the investigation and indigenous groups led the search. They found the backpack containing the pair's personal belongings last week and gathered testimony identifying the killer. Major breakthroughs in this case. The Javari Valley is home to illegal mining, fishing and trafficking. Experts argue the pair's death could be linked to one of these criminal activities. Protesters gathered in Manaus to demand justice. This crime weighs heavy on our hearts and our people. The one who put his life at the disposal and in defense of these people's lives and our territories is gone. The case resonates deeper with indigenous populations and those who defend Brazil's environment. Between discrimination and massive deforestation, they've suffered historic attacks under the country's far-right president, Jair Bolsonaro.